What's up guys, it's Madison here, and if you're new to my channel, which you probably are, you can check out my channel. I make videos of a bunch of different things, so yeah, and excuse me if there's like a slight humming sound in the background, because I just got a new heater, so it's like humming right here, because my room is always cold, so yeah. But anyway, I go thrifting a lot, I like to thrift a lot, so I'm going to make a video, and I think that's pretty self-explanatory, and I keep rambling, so I'm just going to get in the video, so yeah, let's move on. So I love shirts. I have a shirt obsession. It's really bad. So 90% of these things are shirts. I'm pretty sure there's only one jacket and like a pair of boots and the rest are all shirts. So if you don't like shirts, you should probably click out of this video because like, yeah. So I'm going to start with this one. It's blue. But the thing that's cool about this is that it's like not just like regular blue, it's like kind of like batik, I want to say. You know how like they crumble things up except it's not black, it's like with white. So I don't know how they did it, but like... I don't know, I looked, I found this, and it's like really cool looking and different from most like blue shirts and stuff, and the sleeves have this like button up thing, which is really cool. So the first thing that I got is a blue shirt, but it's not just any blue shirt, okay, because it's like kind of like tie-dye or something, or like, it's like batik, except instead of like the black edge thing, it's white, which I don't know how they did this. Maybe it's a mineral wash, but anyway, it's like really cute, and it's kind of flowy. I like the material, and... The sleeves are like buttoned up, so it's kind of cute, you know, and I like it. So, yeah, it's not a basic blue tee, which I really like because I have a lot of basic, like, blue shirts, but I want something that's like different that's not as basic, so yeah. Shut up and sit down. is also a blue shirt as blue is my favorite color so most of the things I do have are blue anyway so yeah and this is like a sweatshirt and it's really cool because it has these like lines down the sleeves that are like white lines what am I what am I saying stripes so yeah and it's blue and it just says 1892 Northeast Division New York and it's by Abercrombie and Finch which I've actually never been in there before but like this really cute sweatshirt and it's like blue so it's like yeah I don't know I just thought it looked really cute and like yeah another blue thing which yeah yeah so this is a shirt and it's like Tommy Hilfiger in New York you can read this anyway so I don't feel like I need to explain it you know and yeah it's blue also it's they're both kind of like sporty you know but it's like a cute kind of like graphic tee I guess I don't know I'm really bad at this don't worry Yeah, finally something that's not blue. So I have this tank top. And it's striped. But it's like knit. So it's really cute. And the stripes aren't like terrible. And I know I see this a lot everywhere. And when I saw this in the store, I'm like, finally, like, I've been wanting like a tank top like this. And again, I like how it's like kind of flowy, you know, and stuff. And it's really basic, so it can be paired with a lot of things. And this is by American Eagle Outfitters. So it's really cute. And yeah. Not much to explain about it. Actually, I have two blouses. This one is really like wrinkly, and so is the other one. So I'm sorry, I'm like the try on portion, but like you know, it's it's cute when it's not wrinkly. Don't don't worry. So I've been looking for a like white shirt specifically for this skirt that I have for like the summertime. So yeah, and I saw this and I was like, this would be perfect to like pair with my skirt because I finally was like found it and stuff like that. 
which I don't know, like, around you where you live or anything, but, like, in my Goodwills a lot, strangely, like, white, like, blouses and stuff, they have a bunch of them there, which I don't know why, because they're, like, really cute, like, staple pieces, but, like, apparently people don't like them anymore, they just don't fit them. So anyway, so there's this shirt, and it has, like, ruffle, like, right here. Madison, that's called a collar. And they also have, like, ruffle, um, sleeves, which I'm not the biggest fan of, just because I feel like I have pretty broad shoulders, and that... They don't look good on me, but like these shirts are still really cute, so I'm probably gonna wear them anyway. So yeah, and then they have like two little buttons right here, and then it's like embroidered all the way down. And then at the bottom, it has the ruffly stuff too. So yeah, and this would also be cute if this was like worn like right here instead of like right here for me, because like yeah, I'll show you. Try. really really soft and I love it like I wish you could feel it like it's really soft and this also kind of has like these cap sleeves I want to say and the edge is really cool like feathery like material I don't know how to explain it and oh yeah I forgot to mention the shirt that I have right there is by St. Ives or something but yeah and so the panel part is really pretty because it's like kind of like lacy but also has like feather panel things I don't know and this is really unique because instead of like buttoning or something, it like snaps, you know, and there's like two snaps and then there's the tassel that you have that you could like tie it, which also has the feathery stuff at the end too. And it's like really pretty color and like it's like blush kind of color and it's really cute. I mean, it's not that cute when it's like wrinkly, but like, you know what I mean? Yeah. next thing I got is a jacket and I've been like looking everywhere for this kind of jacket it's showing up on camera more like yellower than it actually is I mean it's kind of yellow but not like that yellow but anyway this is just this kind of like caramely colored um trench coat type jacket and it has buttons on it and this is not really heavy duty but it's like it's a good material and what I'm really sad about is like one of the buttons came off and I have it but like I don't know what I'm doing with it you know this is by Christopher Banks too so it'll be like really good for a while and the sleeves are cool because they have this like button thingy too so yeah another blue blouse but like I don't know what happened to it it just randomly disappeared so the last thing I got are some boots and they're like booty type thing and they're really cute I need to shut up with this thing they have a slight heel but they're not like terrible and stuff and the thing I kind of don't dislike about this is that it's already kind of like coming off but like these ankle boots are really good when I'm wearing like pants that are kind of like higher up and stuff and I can't wear like my regular boots I would wear them and they are from like Payless I think they were Predictions, yeah, I'm pretty sure that was that Payless. Anyway, I've seen boots like these everywhere. I've always wanted a pair, but I could never find one. So I found this at Goodwill, and I was like, yeah, I'm going to take that. So another thing that I got was this Harley Davidson shirt, which this is the second one I've owned. And I, I've owned, like, I have another one from the summertime. But anyway, so there's a local thrift store and stuff by my school and, like, that stuff. They had this displayed out on the front, and I'm like, oh, wow, this is cute. I'm on it. So it's like gray, it has like the words in like, you know, white, and it has a little pink thing right here, and there's actually nothing inside it, it's just like the logo type thing. It's really weird because I'm not really a big fan of zebra print and stuff, but it has like zebra print on the sleeves and like on the back. On the back it just says Hot Rod Harley Davidson, and like, you know, that kind of font and stuff, so it's really cute, it's gray, I like it. Fever, wild. 
Hey guys, thank you for watching this video. Like and subscribe if you want to. I really don't care. Whatever you feel the need to do. Maybe I'm annoying you. Maybe you like me. It's all good here. So, yeah. Anyway, thanks for watching. See you later. I won't see you later. It's whatever. I don't want to ruin this. Bye!